All right, back at it. Um, yeah, we have ourselves an emperor to rescue. Maybe I... Mm, no, it should be okay. You should be able to take at least one hit from the hobby. Oh, good one. Aha, uh -huh. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I gave, gave it away. So the treasure is indeed behind that. Um... Yeah. Whatever. The golden statue on um, uh, Vishalem's left hand side. The weather outside is, uh, by, the, by the way, pretty well atrocious. <laughs> Where I am right now. Really strong winds, uh, just above zero. It's not quite freezing. And yeah, it rains and it snows and it's just. <laughs> yeah. Very good time to uh, stay inside and play video games, in other words. Let's see. Come on now, Harpy. We have a Bernard with your name on. <laughs> well. Oh? Mm, now what? You make me nervous, game. Yasha has arrived. Oh, you two know him. Yasha, your arrival is surprising as usual. General Fafford was defeated by the Symbios army. Okay, uh, when do we fight Fafford again in scenario one? Well, it was right before. Well, what, soon before the start of the last chapter, I think. Well, before we fought Braff, anyway. What? Are you sure, Yasha? I can't believe the brave and powerful General Fafford has been defeated by Conrad's son. Well, you better believe it, boy. Symbios is capable. High Priest Fiala is our last hope. I have ordered Fafford's son, Braff, to execute our plan sooner than expected. Ah, you're colluding with Braff, you nasty little. So, Symbios has finally, finally reached Flaggard. And what are the pulses? The sound I was heading for him, but I don't think we can count on her at the moment. I also doubt Braff can real light upon so soon after hearing of his father's defeat. Oh, hello. Wait a minute. Was this before the look over? Pulses. I mean, if Basanda has gone after pulses at this point, this would uh, put this uh, event in time at about when Symbios entered Lookover. I also doubt Braff can rely on pulses when he has finished the feet, blah blah blah. If his father has been killed, he will need some time to clear his head. Do we really need his help? Braff has a big role to play. We will need to prevent Aspia from receiving reinforcements. As you requested, the sea gate was captured. They will not be able to use it anymore. Good. Now go with Prince Arant. I will hold off the Minion army while you invade Aspia. Yes, I agree. Cover our escape, Desharon. Remember, our main objective is the invasion of Aspia. We have almost won the war. Act wisely. Don't worry, I'll take care of everything. We wouldn't have a, we wouldn't have had all these setbacks if Medion hadn't helped Simio so much. Okay, well, lengthy cutscene in the middle of everything. What? 
He helped Conrad's son? Your last son doesn't share your ambition. He's causing problems for all of us. I can't believe it. Media. You were really impressed with him, but it seems you misjudged him. It seems our aunt is right. Fancy ninja tricks. Emperor Domeric, Garvin has been plotting against you from the very beginning. Taking Aspia has been the dream of many people for many years. Good, they've made it to the sea gate. Come on, Medion. If you want to save Emperor Domeric, you have no choice but to defeat him. And that's not likely. With your stats, though, phew. I'm just gonna... I could knock you over with my breath. Mm -mm -mm -mm. That ain't happening. So, what can we do with synthesis? We could try this. I'm actually going to go for it. Didn't work. Oh well. Um, wait, can I do that from up here instead? Yes, I can. Oh, wait, I should have used magic. Oh well. Ah, special attack. Good one. Yeah, that's about as much damage as you would deal with magic, I think. I'll have to remember to be a bit careful when I get up there, though. Um, I want that uh, treasure. Or weapon, actually. It's... I suppose not a treasure per se. But I will want that before I accidentally kill the boss. And have I died in the fight outside? That's right. Just uh, going to have a look. Uh, yeah, we're good. Math. Um, oh, they do have yellow uh, faction markers there. I hope that they won't attack me, actually, uh, when I pass them. Let's see. Yep, I can attack them, so they probably won't attack me. That is great. That's just what I want. Synthesis. Well, okay, you have the evil ring. You can use that to cast some magic. That would be great. That was not so great. I need a bunch of ambush spawns. Spawn of Satan. Maybe it would have been a bit more efficient to just um, 
Yeah, go up the other staircase. In terms of... Um, well... Whatever. I know what I'm talking about, so you don't have to. This. Instead of popping him on the nose, I am guessing he won't do much damage. Not that. Actually, did a whole lot of damage there. Uh, I looked away. Well, okay. So it seems like the ring wasn't damaged. That's good. You guys are all okay. Excellent. Alright, seem to be quite alright. Hmm? Good damage for a level 1 spell. Wolves joining on, on the fun down here. And there you go. Boom. Okay, they don't attack me. Good. <laughs> Good to know. Oh, oh. Rock with a dragon act is just terrifying. Okay, should I bother? No. I think I'll have someone else take care of that business. What else do you have? Oh, Phoenix level 2, that's... Uh, let's stick, stick together for now. Hmm. 
Hmm. Maybe on Hasuki and they are becoming quite the tag team, actually. So we don't have any inventory space. Synthesis does, but she's very far away. Yeah, good. Stay there. Let's heal you up because I'm nice like that. I really don't have to. But I choose to do this. Because I can. And it's my choice. So there. Um, let's see, Arthur. What does your inventory look like? <coughs> Check that, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, you could swap it for the angel in. Hello, everyone. Ryudo in the house. That would just invite disaster, I think. Actually, I'm from the line here by the railing. So, how are we gonna do this? I put Arthur here, let's see, how, how much room do you have? You have seven room. Okay. To get to that location, you would need one, two, three, four. Okay, so if I put him here, he should be close enough to reach. Good. Uh, send Uriel with these guys. And um, Rock. Have at them. Although I suppose you are very likely to get a Phoenix 2 in the face, but. Oh well. Risky beeswax. Mm, or maybe it's going to hit media with that. She would have to move. Oh, oh, shit. I meant to push B, but I hit A. Well, at least that guy's dead. <laughs> I'll put David there, that should at least spread the damage from any Phoenix level 2. So, David might not survive the spell, but. <coughs> but maybe I should. Okay. So, we just send in Hasuki, and she can finish that guy. Giving Arthur. A clear run to the item. Hmm. It's almost like I planned this. It's almost like I know what I'm doing. <laughs> what is this nonsense? Ah, so Hasuki could get the item from there as well. Yeah. That happens, I guess.
We don't need no like those herbs. Ah. And you hit Hasuki. Oh. Oops. The good news is she did not hit Miriam. So Miriam can pull back to a safe ish distance. Alright, can you do anything? Not really, no, but you can do that. Okay, Arthur. Rob the place blind. <clears throat> oh, holy halberd. Wow. Uh, yeah, screw the angel wing. Jesus. Holy something. I won't get to see the stats on that thing, will I? Regen, two hit points. Hmm? I like where this is going. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> we are going to get so murdered on the next turn. Cool. And he level three. Nice. Well, excuse me, I'll just need to connect my phone. To the charger. Um, you don't kindly GTFO. There you go. That's a good prince. Oh, wait. You can attack her from there, can't you? Yes, you can. The masked monk. He didn't get to do much, did he? Jesus, Bernard is just. He's going to be the MVP of this entire Let's Play, I'm pretty sure. Oh, we drop an antidote herb for an antidote herb. That is how I roll. Synthesis. Well, yeah. If you're gonna get murdered on the next turn, you might as well go out in style. Surprised. That's Rainer MP though. I think she only has enough MP for one more thing instead of two. And then it's safe to move in Mia. And that will make the fight very short.
You're not, you're not very strong. I don't like that. Uh, let's see, what happens if I equip this thing, except the range one? Mm -hmm. Yeah. He would actually benefit from that. I will have to test this. Well, 12 damage is not that bad, actually, <laughs> for um, Arthur. The region is bound to come in handy, too. Let's see, I'll put you there to dissipate any uh, Phoenix level 2. Which will probably hit David now, come to think of it. Oh well. <laughs> Time to the brakes. Why don't I go and put Rock over by <laughs> David then? Well, it's not like Rock can attack uh, to show him anyway, right? the end of the fight? I think it is. Yeah, Bernard MVP. Hmm. Does anyone have... Well, can anyone make use of the little silver ring though? Anyway, cutscenes. You have defeated a very powerful enemy, High Priestess De Sharon herself. What an impressive victory, Minya. A uh, prince, something. You, if only I had fully recovered, you would have been no match for me. That's true, actually. What's happening to me? I can't die here like this. I will not let you die. Which is true. Uh, she is supposed to band together with Basanda, isn't she in the in the sewers beneath Aspia? That's the voice of Yasha. Did you come to help me? Look, it's Yasha. We can't let him escape with the Sharon. Well, so much for that. I'll see you again, Prince Medium. And poof. We must go after Garvin. Oh, yeah, you're here. And you despise me. Thank you. Why do you want to go after Garvin, Emperor Dominic? The time to retake the land previously lost has finally come. I've been waiting for this for many years. I won't allow Garvin to realize his, his dream in my place. But don't you know about the invasion of the Destomian capital by the Bolsom sect? The, the situation there is dire. The wall. Valkyrie is going to attack. Destonia castle may be in grave danger right now. First we came to us asking for help to protect the capital. What do you propose we do? I think we should return to Destonia with Fiderit as soon as possible. We're not going to return quite yet, Campbell. You've already lent some soldiers to Bresby, haven't you? Then there is no need to go at the moment. We have a splendid opportunity to take back the lands of the Republic. I'm not going to waste this chance. Opportunistic son of a greedy little monkey whore. 
benefit of it is raising an army from the soldiers who betrayed our aunt. They will be my personal guard. Yeah, I guess it really must suck to be Prince of Rohan right about now. You do. Will you prepare your army as well? Well, I guess we can't really say no here, so I'll go along. Your answer surprises me. You have a report with Comrade Sam, and yet you don't oppose the invasion of Aspir. Well... Yeah, I explained my reasoning. Who is this Pegasus Knight? I am honesty from the Rogan army. <clears throat> Since the general is confined in the executor's hold, I will be representing him until we find a way to free him. Honesty is General Rogan's right hand. She can be trusted. And I am going horse. Excuse me? <coughs> hmm, Rogan's right hand. Well, you seem to be a respected officer. I've learned much under General Rogan. I'm prepared to die for our army's safety. I'm relieved to see you are safe, Emperor Amaric. What is the current situation? The sea case was attacked and taken by the Arant army. We won't be able to catch up to it. Also, the executor's mooring was cut and will sink soon. That's why I came here as fast as I could. General Rogan is still trapping the executor's hold. And that's what Zero is out to take care of. The General Rogan is confined in the hold and we are without the key. It seems there's no way to save him. If only it was I who had been trapped instead of him. Unfortunately, these events are common in times of war. Rogan was a good general. We will miss him. So, the stone is being invaded by the Balsam sect. Capital and the castle have probably suffered damage. This is very disturbing. This is the biggest crisis the capital has ever faced. I must contact Majoran immediately. He's probably still in the castle. Could you please deliver a letter to him for me, honestly? Of course, Emperor. It will be a pleasure to serve you. Thank you. I will need time to write it. By the way, who did you send to protect Estonia? Some powerful allies, including Garcia, an innovator from Elbison. Ah, oh, Grantak, I don't think you should have said that. Garcia went there? Did he have a staff of Besson with him? Well, the cat is out of the bag, so we might as well be up front. He did indeed have a staff of Besson with him. So he has the staff of Besson, and he went to Dystonia. But, Emperor... Hmm, this is a very interesting situation. The Emperor is acting very strangely. Why are the questions about Garcia and the staff of Besson? He seems a bit confused. Well, it seems we will have to escort the Emperor to the Republican capital. But to reach it, we will have to traverse Headland and Swampland. Since we no longer have use of the Sea Gate, we will have to head towards the North Mountain Range. While the Emperor takes care of his business, we should prepare ourselves for the departure. Okay, I think I will end the episode here and uh, we will make our departure in the next one. See you then.